Let me show you a quality of life improvement and reduce the file size of this presentation by reducing the size of the pictures. This presentation has 8 megabytes of size with only two simple frames. What we have here are custom fonts and big pictures. If you have a lot of pictures in your presentation and they might be high quality, you can click on a picture, go to picture format, and if you know that you will not use them anymore, not reposition them anymore, you can go to compress pictures. You can select or deselect it, depending if you want to apply these options to the entire presentation or if you want to apply it only to this picture. I want to apply this to the entire presentation with one click and I also want to delete my cropped areas of pictures. I want the picture quality not to be too low, so I'll stay at 150 ppi, which is still a very good quality. You barely will be able to notice the difference. I'll press OK. This option has been applied to the entire presentation, which is to those two pictures. If I save this presentation, the file size will be considerably reduced. You can see from 8 megabytes, we went onto 1 megabyte. Another little thing is fonts take up a lot of space if they are embedded in your presentation. Even if you have those fonts installed on your PC, you need to make sure that if you know that you have those fonts, just go to File, Options, and someone who shared this presentation with you might embed the fonts in the file. If you do not need embedding because you know that you have those fonts on your PC, you just deselect this, you press OK, you save it again, you check the file size and it will be again considerably reduced. How to know if you have those fonts or not? Well, you need to know the fonts you have on your system. Then you simply go to Home, Replace, open the dropdown, Replace Fonts, and just check what fonts are included in this presentation. By default, PowerPoint uses Calibri, but in this presentation I used Chunk 5 and Doses. I did this so I know that I have those fonts, so I do not need embedding into this file, because if I open this file on my PC, the fonts will be perfectly well displayed, because I have them. Those would be two simple tricks to reduce your presentation size. I hope this is a very helpful, and that this little quick tip will reduce your presentation sizes.